Alright, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to um, strip and tin your wire. Um, this is going to make it ready for it to go attached to the LED. Um, since the LEDs are already tinned, you want to do tin the wire so it attaches a lot quicker. And um, it will securely attach to it without having the risk of pop falling off. So since this is an 18 gauge solid wire, um, by by you can tell if it's solid or stranded it's in the core uh, if the core has multiple strings or um, strands of copper in it that means it is um, a stranded wire since this is only one big thick copper wire inside of it it means it's a solid core wire uh, I'm gonna go ahead there's two different sides on the on your wire stripper if you do get this type um, there's 18, 16, 14, 12, and 10. This is the AWG solid side. And the other side is the stranded side. So if you have a stranded string, you're going to have to go with the stranded notches here. And since I have a solid um, wire, I'm going to go ahead and do it, notch it, and strip it with the solid side. So I'm going to go ahead and place the wire onto the 18 notch just like that and um, since it, I need to keep it in um, a little bit of a tip not that big just as much as I'm showing you right here um, the reason for that is you don't want the wire to be too exposed and the black insulation or whatever color insulation you have on your wire is going to protect it from shorting um, the whole device or whatever your um, your LEDs and stuff like that so I'm going to go ahead and you're going to squeeze the tip of it just like that and then pull and then there you go you have a stripped wire now you're going to go ahead and place it on your alligator clip that way you have both hands free to carry your uh, flux wire and your soldering iron and what you want to do is you want to get your soldering iron onto the tip of the wire that you exposed and keep it on it for a little bit until it war um, heats up enough for it to melt the flux wire onto it and once you know once you can tell it's hot is by mm, just giving it a few seconds you don't want it to do it too much because this is what can happen right here see that it melted the wire that way I know it's too much of a time so I'm gonna go ahead and flip it over to the other side don't do that with your wire you have to throw it away if that happens it's just ruining the insulation on the wire so you just put your soldering iron onto the tip of the wire just a little bit and then get your your um, your flux wire onto it and then it should absorb it really quick and then you have a tinned and stripped wire ready to go onto the LEDs.